hello good morning uh, today uh, we are going to see about uh, corrosion measurement rates and units um, myself mohammad salman sharif from second year civil engineering let's get to the ppt yeah to, the contents uh, today we are going to see is sub uh, art pictorial understanding like um, the graphs which show the uh, pic, um, the corrosion rate and what is mean by corrosion rate units of measurement corrosion penetration rate corrosion rate measurement through faraday equation as you can see the first graph is uh, versus the corrosion rate versus uh, dissolved oxygen the corrosion rate is expressed in terms of a millimeter per year the dissolved oxygen is uh, particle per uh, particles per million as you can see here like uh, as the corrosion as the dissolved oxygen content increases the corrosion rate increases up to uh, up to a rate of 0.8 in the corrosion rate and uh, it, it has from varying temperatures like uh, 50 degrees celsius and uh, 32 degrees celsius and 90 degrees celsius which have different uh, graphs like you have seen uh, like it is differentiated in the like, pointed graph in the next graph we can see the graph the corrosion rate versus sodium chloride percentage which is dissolved in the which is present in the uh, uh, steel or uh, whatever uh, material we are uh, like testing as the sodium chloride uh, percentage increases in the object the corrosion rate uh, increases up to a certain level and goes and uh, decreases to the decreases after uh, decreases after a certain extent here uh, here uh, another graph which shows the temperature versus uh, cor corrosion rate versus temperature graph in a closed system which is under a confined environment here the graph is linear um, like uh, as you can see here the graph is linear but in open system the graph is parabolic uh, linear to certain excess and goes parabolic and uh, the point which uh, touches the x axis is shown in the dotted lines corrosion rate corrosion rate is a speed at which any metal deteriorates in a specific environment the rate at which the material deteriorates uh, is known as a corrosion rate uh, it depends upon metals and uh, specific atmospheric conditions Uh, as, we, as we can see here, uh, there is a table which shows the conversion units and rates. Uh, conversion units, uh, as you can see, the first column is from and to, and the, uh, it should be multiplied by what? Uh, the MPY, which means that mils per year. The mils per year is nothing but it is used to measure the corrosion rate in pipes and uh, small tubes, etc. Uh, millimeter per uh, MMPY indicates the millimeter per year. Uh, the first week uh, as we can see here the uh, when we convert the miles per year to gram per meter square into d in the year d indicates the metal density in grams per cubic centimeter or megagrams per cubic meter as you can see here which it should be multiplied by 0.0696 into d from uh, here and uh, from uh, miles per year to millimeter per year we should multiply by 0.0254 and in inches per year to millimeter per year 25.54 inches per year to gram per meter square into density uh, 69.5 d and so on mdd indicates milli milligram per square decimeter per day as you can see mdd uh, from mdd to millimeter per year uh, we should multiply by 0.0365 uh, divided by d Uh, here uh, as we can see here what rates of corrosion are acceptable uh, as as per engineering standards um, less than 0.1 mm per year uh, is equal to good corrosion resistance 0.1 to 1 mm per year that is so 4 to 40 miles per year may be satisfactory uh, up to extent greater than 1 mm per year is usually excessive corrosion Uh, as you can see with the example here on a ship if the anchor of the ship is corroded at a rate of 1 mm per year it would not disturb anyone as it is a, a like negligible resistance uh, sorry negligible, negligible corrosion but at the bearing of the ship's compass which is a of small surface area uh, it would be like uh, if the corrosion is 0.1 mm per year that is 0.4 miles per year it, uh, it becomes intolerable due to the small surface area of the bearing uh This is the engineering standards which follows the thumb rules as follows. Where it, it has three thumb rules. Um, less than 0.1 millimeter per year is a good corrosion resistance of the substance. 0.1 to 1 millimeter per year is uh, satisfactory. Uh, if the object 
corals at a rate of greater than 1 mm per year it is usually it is an excessive corrosion corrosion penetration rate corrosion penetration rate uh, uh, defines that the corrosion rate or the rate of material removal as a consequence of a chemical reaction is an important corrosion parameter it is expressed in uh, expressed as cpr a thickness loss of material per unit time a formula is cpr equal to k w divided by rho into a into t where k Uh, where w is the weight loss after the exposure time t when the material is exposed to the open environment how much the weight is lost it is noted by a capital w rho and d represent the density and exposed specimen area of the specimen k is a constant it differs from material to material it is exp- uh, the cpr is expressed in terms of mpy or m mm per year in the first case k equal to 534 to give cpr in mpy In the second case, K equal to 87.64 mm per year. As you can see, the given link is used to find the corrosion rate. And another uh, equation known as co- corrosion measurement through Faraday's equation. Uh, this equation is, um, can be denoted R equal to I divided by N into F4, where uh, the rate R in units of mole per meter square per second is determined using the expression. Thank you.